Hi everybody, for this week we're going to be talking about Andy Warhol and a little bit about the movement that he's a part of, which is pop art. So, his life, um, Andy Warhol was born in, on August 6, 1928 in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. His mother was an embroider and an artist, and she taught him how to draw. Um, when he graduated from high school, he went to Carnegie Mellon University to study art. So here's some of his work. So a little bit about his work. After graduating from college, he moved to New York in 1959 to make his name as an artist. In one of his first jobs, his name in the credits was misspelled Warhol instead of Warhola, which is his real name. He liked the name and decided to keep Warhol. In 1961, Andy came up with the concept of using mass-produced commercial goods in his art, and he decided to call it pop art. Andy also used pictures of famous people. Um, he would repeat the same portrait over and over, but use different colors and effects in each picture. So here are two of his works, and we're going to see them a little bit up close right now. And so here are some videos that you can check out about him and a little bit about pop art as well. And so for Schoology, um, I really like that Andy Warhol could create colorful, colorful screen prints of whatever or whomever he wanted. If he were alive today, I would want him to make me 100 screen prints of my dogs because I love them and I would hang, hang them up on my wall. So what about you guys? If Andy Warhol were alive today, what screen prints would you want him to create for you? Please respond on Schoology. Thank you.